Welcome back, and it's great to have you here with us at mid-morning on WKYT. It's Cervical Health Awareness Month, and White House Clinics, which is based down in the Madison, Garrett, uh, Estill County, that area, is encouraging women to get screened for cervical cancer. Here to tell us more about it, Stephanie Moore, the CEO of White House Clinics, and Tammy Gross, a nurse practitioner. Thank you very much for coming in. Important information. Absolutely. Good morning. Thank you. We appreciate you being here. Let's let's start with the clinical first. And, and the question is that this is a, a cancer that can be prevented? Yes, it can. Cervical cancer is typically caused by a virus called HPV, which is a common virus that a lot of people actually have. Usually don't have a lot of symptoms early on. We have a vaccine that actually can prevent HPV, but it's a very slow growing virus as well. So the preventative screenings allow us to catch the cervical changes and the cells early and allow us to treat and do things to prevent that as well from growing. Uh, when you're talking about the preventative screenings, what are those? A pap smear is how we screen for cervical cancer. And a pap smear is uh, where we take like a small broom brush that looks like a small makeup fan brush that's used to sweep away cells from the cervix and that is sent out to the lab for testing. It's usually painless, there's no discomfort, it's a quick, easy test that can be done in the office. You uh, do this uh, kind of uh, test at the White House clinics? We do. Women can have the test at their primary care provider, such as Tammy, or you can go to your gynecologist and have that screening as well. You know, for people who have not heard of the White House clinics, you serve a lot of people. Yes, ma'am, about 30,000 patients per year. And have been at it uh, for a while. <laughs> Almost 45 <laughs> years. Realize that. Uh, would you, do you uh, reach a specific uh, type of population or just uh, generally open to the public? We're open to anyone. Um, quite frankly, um, I think that that's one of the common misconceptions that is that we're only here to serve um, low income or the uninsured, but we accept patients with commercial insurance, uninsured patients, um, or patients with any Medicare or Medicaid plan. Tammy, I'm sure that it makes you feel really good when you catch something in an early stage. Yes, and you know, that's one thing that's very near and dear to my heart. I still have my mother to this day because she did her cancer screenings and that's been 19 years later, so. Whitehouseclinics.com for more information. I assume that during the special month you have some information on there about uh, this uh, uh, type of situation you want to raise people's awareness of. Yes. Absolutely. Kentucky is eighth in the nation for cervical cancer cases, but yet we're in the bottom third for screening. And um, this is a quick and easy screening, so we really encourage women to get that done. We can improve those numbers. Thank you very much for coming in.